What's going on everyone? Today I'm going to talk about another really great model kit from AMT. So smash that like button to show your love for AMT and the old hobby of building kits. But first, I want to talk about the name on the box. When I was growing up, these were such a great treat to get at the store and were never just around the house. I'm Logan, the 64th Gear Jammer Skill, and I'm talking about Hostess Cakes. Of course, the most famous Hostess Cake product is Twinkies! That yummy snack cake that had absolutely no food value at all. Talk about the perfect snack. Twinkies were invented not by Hostess Cake, but by its owner, Continental Baking Company that made strawberry shortcake. As a way to put the mini idle machines back to work when strawberries were out of season. The banana cream filled Twinkie was born. However, World War II rationing caused the popular banana cream Twinkie production to be suspended. To not let the machines sit idle again, a new flavor had to be developed. Vanilla cream was introduced and became such a hit with customers that the original banana cream flavor was only available from time to time in very limited productions. The ever popular Twinkie did take a hit in sales as snack eaters began looking to healthier snack foods in the mid 2000s. This terrible turn put Hostess Cake into bankruptcy and brought a halt to Twinkie production from November of 2012 to July of 2013. A very sad time for junk food lovers. The return of the Twinkie was met with criticism as the taste just wasn't the same. So much for an American icon. While we all think of Twinkies as a low nutritional value food, well, no nutritional value. A professor wanted to prove that calorie counting was the only real way to lose weight. To do this, he created the convenience store diet, where he ate mainly low nutritional value foods found at convenience stores. On his diet, he kept a strict calorie count of daily calorie intake and lost 27 pounds over a two month period and returned his body mass index to normal for his height. Who would have thought that Twinkies could help you lose weight? Hostess Cake's first product was the Hostess Cupcake, which came out in 1919 and thought to be the first snack cake introduced to the market. There is some debate on this as Tasty Cake has tossed their hand in saying the Tasty Cake was first. I have no idea who really was first and I really don't care. What I'm sure of is that we all know this wonderful chocolate cake with vanilla cream filling, chocolate icing, and signature vanilla icing on top. Hostess Cake continues on today under different ownership. The bankruptcy turned into liquidation and Hostess was sold to Apollo Global Management. Apollo brought the famous products back into production in 2013 to the delight of both junk food lovers and healthy snack fans alike. After saving the beloved snack cake brand, Apollo has since sold Hostess brands as a publicly traded company. Now. Let's go on and talk about one of the model kits that AMT produced for Hostess Cakes. And this is the Ford C600 City Delivery with Trailmobile van box on it for Hostess Cake. It's a 125th scale AMT model kit in their Retro Deluxe series. Featuring an operating power tailgate, functional overhead door, all new decal sheet and the vintage packaging. This artwork is from 
back in the late 70s, early 80s when they came up with this kit originally. Great, great packaging back when artwork was all hand drawn. Now we get here and you can see many of the parts that are in this kit. You can see here where the door is designed to roll up and down. The tailgate is designed to go up and down. It has the 534 cubic inch Super Duty V8 engine, a full detailed engine that you can build for this thing, big block Ford. It has five spoke Dayton spider wheels with authentic vinyl truck tires. Then they have a great vintage tread pattern on them that is very, very prototypical of these trucks. It has chrome air horns and chrome plated fuel tanks. It also has a Kaiser air conditioner to put on the roof. You don't have to put that on if you don't want to, but they look kind of cool. Now paint and cement are not included in the kit. On this side here, we can just see it is the Ford C600 City Delivery, a super detail 125th scale, and, then, and its item number is AMT 1139. Around on this side, you can see some highlights from the kit. You can see how the graphics all go on the box, the door on the side of the box, the operating power lift tailgate right there, so you have a lift gate, there was suspension, the heavy duty frame, and this cab tilt. Isn't that cool? You can put Hostess logos on the cab, or if you don't want Hostess, you could use other graphics or make your own to make this whatever you want. The side door does open, the tilting cab and look it has that special feature of the Todd Co operating power tailgate now this is the parts overview for this model you can see it has parts that are molded in white and it has parts that are molded in chrome transparent red transparent amber and clear now you have a whole lot of parts most of them are molded in white here you have the box sides, the box top, the box, and all your box parts. Then you have over here, you have doors, rear panel doors, mud flaps, steering wheel, and the mud flaps could have four badges on them if you want. It has the frame rails. Come down here, you've got axle and suspension parts. Then you have in transmission detail, dashboard and some other parts for the interior the cab body is one piece but it mounts on the frame you have your black vinyl tires and then you have more engine parts right here in this sprue uh, frame exhaust everything you need the clear parts include the headlights your transparent red ones include your brake lights and marker lights that would be red your transparent amber are your turn signals and marker lights it. Now, chrome parts. It has the chrome wheels, chrome rings, some chrome parts that hang under the frame. It even looks like it has a chrome fifth wheel, even though you build this in a straight truck. It's got the chrome fuel tanks, chrome, this, that, and the other. And then over here was another piece with some more chrome. Down here, it has the item number and it's UPC, plus you can see the sticker showing that this is an officially licensed Ford product. It's made in China. Be careful, these parts are very small, so it's not for kids. And then it is made by Round 2 Models today with, at round2models.com. It's the 125th scale plastic model kit made by AMT. Round 2 bought AMT from Tomy after leasing it for a while and that's why we keep getting these great wonderful kits put out because Tomy would have stopped a long time ago and to learn more about AMT watch my AMT video on the history of AMT models now there's also for this one a water slide decal sheet it's an all-new sheet with the hostess cakes they updated it from before so that it's a really nice set for your model. And that, my friends, is the AMT Ford C600 City Delivery with Trailmobile Box for Hostess Cakes. It's a 125th scale plastic model kit by AMT, and they're great fun to build. So make sure you grab any of the model kits today and put one together. It's a great, great pastime. Hostess Cake, are you a fan of any of it? 
Let me know what your favorite Hostess product is down in the comments. The Ford C600 is one of my all-time favorite trucks. Great cab design and versatile from a straight truck all the way up to a tandem road tractor. Ford really hit it out of the park with the C-Series trucks. AMT made a great model kit of this famous truck for Hostess. Actually, they made two different Ford C-Series model kits for Hostess. This C600 City Delivery straight truck with a box on it and a C900 single axle tractor with 27 foot trail mobile dry van trailer. Talk about cool. Unfortunately, both are no longer available other than luck on the secondary market. So good luck to finding them today. While I don't have either of the AMT model kits, I do happen to have, while supplies last, two different 148 scale step vans for Hostess Cake. And you can get them with a link down below. Once they are sold out, the link will disappear forever, so don't delay in ordering. Thanks for watching everyone. Please go on and smash that like button, share this video, and subscribe to my channel. I'm Logan, the 64th Gear Jammer Skeel, and I'll be back soon with another episode of Toy Talk and some new content.